What an amazing art set! I'm so jealous. How am I supposed to use this? Hmm, maybe I can repair my brush. I just need some hair. I hope Sarah doesn't notice. This'll be enough. I'll attach it to the brush. Now I can paint. Uh, that looks familiar. Like, really familiar? Is that… is that my hair? My hair! What have you done?! Give me that! Huh? I'll take even more hair! Oh, stop right now. There's only one thing for it. Detention? Okay, I wasn't expecting that. Where are we? Hi, it's time for an art challenge. The wheel will decide what you draw. One, two, three, go! Ooh! A flower? Okay, that should be easy. Do we have to do this? I don't know what to do. Hang on. I think I have an idea. I'm a genius! I'll lay my jewelry across the paper. Now I'll paint over them. I don't need a lot of paint. And I'll use different colors. Okay, that should be it. I'll use the tip of the paintbrush to drag the chains across the paper. I'll smear the paint, too. It'll blend all the colors. It's my version of a flower. Pretty good, huh? Wow! I'm impressed. Now I can do my makeup. <gasps> Now's my chance. I need to look good. I have a reputation, you know. Yeah, that's great. This is just what I need. Now I can create my flower! I'll dab the paint on with this makeup brush. Then do the same with green paint. This is looking great! I'll add some details. And that's it! It's so pretty! I better get rid of this. What are you doing? Nothing! Good. Don't distract me from my makeup. I look so glamorous. Oh, time's up! What do you think? It's striking, isn't it? Mine's more subtle. Excellent work. Very interesting, Sarah. <laughs> I knew you'd like it. Oh, no way! What's so funny? You have paint on your face! My beautiful skin! No! It's a work of art, Sarah. Display it to the world! Your paintings are excellent! Well done, both of you! Howdy, folks. Think you can draw this? Now get going! Psh! This is gonna be a piece of cake! <laughs> Pink's the name of the game this round! Oh yeah! First comes the paper cup! Bubblegum pinks my face! Oh! She didn't even consider sizing! I'd say that's about five inches. Hmm. And now on to the yummiest part. So good. But maybe green was the wrong choice. Oh. Yes? Is that supposed to be ice cream? Whoa! I didn't mean to draw this! You want a green, right? Amateur mistake. I say the more realistic, the better. Starting with the big, creamy scoops. Color should always come second. You create a better foundation this way. See what I mean? You can't go wrong with all the little details. See? Ice cream! It's written right on the cup. And now it's finally time for some color. All this ice cream is making me hungry. That's what happens when you get real with what you're drawing. Almost done! Just a few more details here. And there! I'm finished! Feast your eyes on this! Huh? Oh, let me see here. Now that's what I call a masterpiece! Here! Yeah! Whoa! It turned into a real bucket of ice cream! This may be the best prize yet! Mmm! Ugh, this is torture! I don't even like broccoli. Ugh, it tastes like a tree. 
Have a cool idea for an art piece, but not sure how to tackle it? Don't worry, we've got some handy little tricks to turn regular ideas into true masterpieces! Now let's get those creative juices flowing! Maybe if I add a little more here. Or some shading. Oh, I can't believe I'm late! Gabby! Huh? Hi there! Sorry, may I? Okay. Thank you! <laughs> what did I miss? Attention! Okay, class. Time to go! Hear you loud and clear! Jeez. I think I can make one of those. But not with paint. Gotta work with this. Challenge accepted! Ooh! Hope I brought enough supplies. Huh? Huh? Shoo! Excuse me. Wait a minute. Look! It's an eraser! But what can I do with that? Look at all of his supplies! He's got a million brushes! And I've got zero. Huh? Let me think here. Ahem. Do you mind sharing some stuff? What, mine? Uh-huh. Paint? I don't think so. Oh, he's so selfish. Guess I'm on my own here. But I have a brilliant idea! Don't mind me. Teacher's not looking, right? Oh, good. I'll take this. What else is in this thing? Nothing. Bingo! Paint, baby! Now to get back to my desk! He's already halfway done! <sighs> Let's start with some red, shall we? And without brushes, fingers it is! But fingers can give a lot of cool texture. Can you tell it's a parrot yet? These thick strokes look like feathers. It's really coming together, see? It's just so realistic looking! <sighs> All right, brushes down, class. Justin, ready? I know, it's really good. Um, well, it's okay, Justin. Let's see yours, Gabby. I improvised. No brushes necessary. <sighs> I can't believe my eyes! That's incredible! Bravo, Gabby! Oh yeah? Thank you! Mm, no hard feelings? There you go! Perks of being an artist, huh? Ready for the next challenge? A cactus? You're going down! I doubt it, you are. This should be easy. Gotta keep my energy up. Feel no stress. You're one with the pen! I nearly finished! Done at last! Phew! Spot the difference. It's hard, isn't it? What is that? Watch and learn. I'll drag the sponge down the paper. Then use smaller sponge for the limbs. Now for the flowers. All I need to do is add some details. I might frame this afterwards. What do you think? Well, they're both green. Don't give up the day job. This isn't even gonna be a contest. Wow! A cactus pinata! Think there's candy inside? Only one way to find out! I'll put on this blindfold. Okay, time to work out some tension. It's glorious! Look! Huh? Did you say something? Where did she go? Hello? <laughs> Meh, her loss. 
What happened? <gasps> hey! Where did this candy come from? Uh, what the heck is going on with her now? I really don't get her. What's she doing with those towels? Hi, yeah, we're still here, remember us? Well, okay, fine then. Here, have this flamingo. Oh, a flamingo. Okay, this should be fun. I'm gonna go with my favorite method and trace my hand. Okay, good. Now to rotate my paper. This bird is gonna need a head for sure. And then of course his big beak. Okay, eye is done. Now for the wings. And can't forget his long legs. Now for the color. Can't have a flamingo with some pink. He's gonna be so pretty when I'm done. I just know it. Just keep coloring. Just keep coloring. Just a little bit more and… done! Let me see. Gotta make sure to get the scale right. Eh, I'll just wing it. <laughs> that was a pretty good pun, if I say so myself. Okay, he looks something like this, I think. Okay, sure, that's a flamingo, I guess. Phew. That refreshing bath was just what I needed. What do you got? Ew. What is that? Some sort of weird chicken? Aw, yeah, sorry. I have to agree with her. Yours looks very nice, though. You win the flamingo challenge. Congrats! Yes! I won one all on my own. Listen, don't feel so sad. I'll share, of course. Here. Thanks! This does help me feel better. I've got a good feeling about this one. Well, that's disappointing. I thought this was a challenge. Okay, what should I use this time? Too big. Nah, I'm not feeling it. This is perfect. A pumpkin should be straightforward. It's an orange circle. I need to win this one! Okay, this'll do. I'll start with the sections. Then the stem. Now to fill it in. A different shade and color will make it look good. with that. What do you think? Hey, wake up! Hello? Yoo-hoo! Wake up! We're supposed to be drawing! I'm awake! What's going on? Oh, right. The pumpkin. Great. Time's up. This is the best I can do. You've got a little something on your cheek. Really? What? Aw, paint. It suits you! Yes! What's the prize? Mmm! Pumpkin juice? This isn't nice. I… I feel funny. What's happening? Do I have a pumpkin for a head? Ah! At least you have a costume for next Halloween! <laughs> I hate this game! Ah! My face! My beautiful face! It's back! Oh, sorry, I got a fright! I'm never drinking this again! Hey, keep it over there! Hey, are you seeing what I'm seeing? Oh my gosh! It's got really long teeth! Oh no! It's getting a lot bigger! <laughs> Don't worry, you two. I can't hurt ya. Well, that's a relief. But that's our cue for the next drawing challenge. Huh, okay, so we have the number five on our papers. I think I know what I can do with this. I just gotta start by adding lines to what's already there. Little squiggles down the back. An eye, of course. And can't forget the teeth. Dinos need legs and arms, too. He needs to walk around. Okay, time to add some color. I want him to look fearsome. Just a little bit more and done! Yes! He looks great! Keep your eyes on your own paper this time! Hey! Ugh, come on, can't you let me have even a little peek? Hey, wait a second! Pencils! These are definitely gonna help me with my problem. Okay, just need some tightening over here. Maybe another adjustment to this pencil. I made the erasers on the pencils into shapes! A heart on this one, and a star over on this one. Alright, let me flip this over so I can put these to work. Okay, back to my good old trusty marker. I need a sort of egg shape. And now for the erasers. I'll just dip them into the paint. Time to start dabbing. Alright, stop. Let's see your artwork, please. Well, here's mine, miss. I hope you like him. And here's mine. He hasn't hatched yet, though. What? I don't know if that counts. Oh, but yours is great. You're the winner. Me? Really? Yes! Thank you so much! I love these chips. But they're even better when shared with a friend. 
Besides, I thought your egg was really cute. Thank you. Ooh, this is exciting! A unicorn! Hmm, this might be tricky. I'm going for the pens. I don't know, so many options. Paint… Or pens. Pens! I think this is the right choice. Okay, here goes. Oops! My pen slipped. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, it slipped. Okay. You're so immature. Let me help improve your drawing. Don't you do that again. I warned you. I improved it. Oh, you missed a spot. I'll help you color it in. Gah! This is pointless. Take that! Quit it! Stop it! We could do this all day long. Take some more paper. Fine, but I'm facing this way. I'm gonna draw the best unicorn ever. Got it! U N I C O R N. Now I just need to join it up. I'll give it a nice hairstyle. Can't forget the legs. All I have to do now is color it in. Pink will be the perfect color. I think this will win. I wish I had a real unicorn. All that's left is the tail. Done! That was easy. Ta-da! Oh no! Here's my drawing. It's… good. Well done. I wonder who won this round. <laughs> well, I'm shocked! Yes! What's the prize? Please be a real unicorn! I can live with that. This won't do. Too small. Let me see. Aha! That looks so tasty! Maybe I could try a little piece. She won't notice. This is what I need! Stand back! This is about to get messy! You didn't! Sorry! I tripped Anna! Uh, landed on the cake! I saved you some! You're unbelievable! I offered. Okay, first challenge! I wonder what it is! Oh, what a cute puppy! Can we keep it? Okay, I can do this! Hmm. I've seen artists do this. No idea why, but it looks good. It's quite small for a puppy. Wait, I know what to do. Huh? I've got a hand too. Big deal. Ah, I get it. This is easy. I'll trace around my hand. What are you doing? At least she's happy. I'll put my hand on the paper like this. Then draw around it. Now to make it look like a dog. Some fur, cute little eyes, and a nose. I'll add some color now. This is turning out well. Gotta stay in the lines. Almost finished. There! He's so adorable! I'm proud of that. I'll call him Lucky. That's actually quite good. I mean, I like mine, but… Wow. At least you tried. <laughs> Who won? Yeah! Look! Something's happening! Biscuits! Yummy! It's shaped like a bone! Genius! I love the dog theme. I can't wait to try it. Hold on. Biscuits? Bone? Dog? Stop! They're, they're not for you! Now these taste great! I need the recipe! Ooh, I wish you hadn't done that. What's uh, up? These biscuits. They're for the puppy. <gasps> Could you not have told me that? Serves you right. Hey, come here, boy. We have goodies. Come on. Oh, who's the best boy? You are. Yes, you are. You must be hungry after all that posing. You're such a clever puppy. On you go. It's for you. Um, wow. What is she even doing up there? Oh, right. I have students now. First up, I want to see you draw a unicorn, all right? Get to work. Ew, this toothbrush was just in her mouth. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Is this what I think it is? Yuck! Get this away from me! Well, I don't want it! Oh wait. It's actually giving me an idea! Time to get to work on my unicorn drawing. Gotta start with some colorful paint, of course. Rainbows are great for unicorns. Now I'm gonna use this toothbrush to make a mane pattern. Okay. I definitely don't need a toothbrush to plan my own picture. Using a marker. Okay, got the ears, the horn. He needs some eyes, of course. Oh, let me see how yours is doing. 
Ugh, yeesh. That's something all right. No, I'm so bad at drawing unicorns. Yikes. Well, better get back to my picture. Oh, I know. It's magic wand time. Ta-da! The rest of the unicorn has appeared. Ooh, I really like how this turned out. Yay me! Aw, yours turned out so pretty. Well, hey, we still have time to fix yours. I have an idea. I'll just press your paper against mine. Look, see? You have a duplicate now, too. Hey, miss, I think we're done with our pictures. Wow, girls, those turned out great. I'm really impressed with both of you. Yes, we did it, and we both get prizes. Cheers! It's a heart this time. You'll need some more supplies. Go for it, girls! Look at all these pens! Wow! That's all I've got. Seriously? <laughs> Good luck. Oh, I have an idea. This will look amazing. I'll draw a giant heart. So far, so good. Now I'll draw a smaller heart inside. It's perfect! That's awful! Hey, look at my drawing! That's nice. I suppose I better draw something. Hang on. I have an idea. I'll use the pen and the pencil at the same time. Now for the fun part. I'll draw lines across the center of the heart. That should do it. Now I'll add shading. I'll add thicker shading at parts to create shadows. This is going to plan! Now I'll cut it out around the top of the heart. Miss, miss! I finished! <laughs> Sorry. Okay, let's see your art. Ooh, very clever, Molly. I like it. Uh, Sarah? Where is your heart? It's over there! Oh! It's… It's like street art. Different approaches, but both excellent. I love them. Aw, thanks! This looks so cute! Matthew will love it! Oh… Maybe not. I'll need to fix it. Great. I don't have an eraser. It's fine. There'll be one in my pencil case. Where is it? I know I have one. Hold on. Gina, can I use your eraser, please? Sure. Here you go. Oops. Hey, you. Thanks. I appreciate it. Just what I need. Matthew still has it! I'll go see him. He'll be so surprised. Phew. Matthew lives far away. At least I don't need a shower later. I should have brought a jacket. I can't wait to see him. What? You look so pretty today. I don't believe it! And with my eraser! This is the worst! Stupid Matthew! How could he? I'm never gonna give him my eraser again! <gasps> what am I gonna do? Gina! Uh, how long have you been there? Use the sharpener. How? Wait a minute. I've got it! Thanks! I should've thought of this earlier! I'll start by flipping the sharpener over. Then I'll cover the underside of the sharpener with glue. I'll fill it all the way to the top. Now to let it set. That should do it. The glue will erase the pencil. It's working perfectly! Now to finish my drawing. Huh? I thought I could help. And I got you this. I'm sorry. La 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 la. Woohoo! Oh! Oops. Sorry, class. What do we have this time? A star! Begin! What's this? Paint supplies? Whatever. Molly can have it. Ooh! Look at this! Wow! This must be my lucky day! I'll place a template over the page. And I've coated the brush in different paint. I'll paint over the template. 
It gives a great effect. Now I'll carefully remove the template. Wow! It's like a rainbow! I love it! That's the best you can do? I need to make a call. Hello? Yeah, I need some help. Ahem. What's going on here? Draw a star? <laughs> Easy. That's nothing to a professional like me. Watch and learn. Something more challenging would be nice, but what can you do? And I'm done! You can applaud now. I know, I'm talented. Oh, are you finished? Oh. My word. You are a work of art. You are my muse. Oh, you? I could paint you every day. Uh, should I leave? I've never seen such beauty. This is for you. You're so romantic! I feel so inspired when I'm around you. Let's go! Hey, come back! My painting! Aw. Aw, this picture sure is cheery. Good enough to be framed. And why stop there? Just need some inspo. Mm-hmm. Right. You said what? Oh, Susan, you're bad! Ugh, I don't know. Um, excuse me? My paper! Oh! My bad. Oops. Look what you've done! It's ruined! Hey! Can I show you something? Ever hear of a happy accident? This is one of them. Oh. Me? Yeah! You can do different sizes, too! Amazing! Let's do it! How many do you think can fit on here? As many as you want! Things are getting crazy! You can use pretty much anything. As long as it's circular, of course. You think we've done enough yet? It sure looks cool, doesn't it? Up high! My little artist. Oh, are you waiting on me? Let's spin the wheel. This is so much fun! Okay, a rainbow. I need lots of paint. That should be easy enough. It's just drawing a curve. Okay, this is harder than I thought. Ugh! Ugh that didn't go well. Actually, maybe I can use that. I think I've got it! I'll take a strip of paper and fold it like this. Now I'll draw a cute little face. Now for the eyes. I'm liking this so far. I'm feeling so creative! Hey, careful! Oops. It'll probably improve your drawing. Okay, now for some color. I don't want to color the eyes yet. This pink is so bright. I should get nail polish this color. The collar can be yellow. And the eyes can be green. What a happy looking cat! It even has a rainbow smile! I'll show Molly. Boo! It's so funny! Uh, I better clean up the paint Sarah spilled. This is making it worse. Wait. I can use this! What a great idea! I've painted this canvas blue. I can use the sponge to make a white cloud. Now I'll let orange paint run down. I'll do the same with different colors. There! All done! Hey, watch the face! Teacher, look at this! Oh, let me see, Molly. It's so unique and colorful. It's beautiful. Boo! Wow! So playful, Sarah. I'm proud of you both. You deserve a reward. We did amazing, Sarah! Okay. This spot looks substantial. Yeah? The trees, nature, what have you. The heat is on! You bet! I don't know… What? Hey, stop looking at mine! Whatever. Fine. I'll be over here then. 
What can I paint? Bingo! He's adorable! I hope David didn't see him. I saw it first! Uh-huh. May the best bird painter win! A few skillful circles can go a long way. Just have to know where to add the lines. Nice, right? But some color will really make it pop. Yellow is such a happy color, isn't it? It's perfect for such a cheerful guy. And how about some green? Such a peaceful hue. And add some blue for a real treat for the eyes. Doing the edges first is always best. It really rounds things out, doesn't it? Almost done! Just a couple of finishing touches. And that's how it's done, folks! A true masterpiece! Don't you agree? Yep, I'm pretty pleased. What is that? I just needed an extra hand! Turns out, a hand is all you really need. Well, that and a few strategically placed dots and lines. Can you see the bird face yet? Don't worry, it'll all come together soon. These branches ought to give it away. And here are its cute little feet. A little greenery? I think it's quite peaceful. Can you see the bird now? I'm just so creative, aren't I? Well, if you really want to see it… Not too shabby. Oh. I guess they're both pretty great. Should we ask the teacher? Seriously? I hope he's okay. Seems like he's just fast asleep. Hey! Ooh. All done, huh? Oh, great job. Now just give me, uh, five more minutes. Alrighty then. That's correct. Well done. Oh, come on! Now this is my kind of studying. Back you. I might have known. Wait, did it suddenly get cold in here? You should be doing classwork. I get bored easily. Don't worry, I'll switch it off. Is that better? Huh? How did… what the… Awesome book! <clears throat> Maybe I can finish my game! Ugh! What's happening? You need to study. And I'll keep this. It's not fair! He's right, it is a good game. Okay, for your last challenge, draw me a butterfly! Okay, I can do this. I know I can. Or maybe I can't? Wait, no! I've got a good idea now! This should totally work! I'll just start by tracing the shape of this roll of tape. <laughs> that rhymed! Okay, that should be good enough. Now I need another one here. It's not that hard, tracing. But I still don't want to mess up. Oh, like that! Huh? What's she doing? Oh, I get it! That's smart! But while she's doing that, I've got my own tracing plan. Here's the cute picture of the butterfly she wants us to draw. I can just put this paper over the tablet. And now I can just trace the picture like this. Wings are done. Now onto the body and head. Oh, the antenna. Time to make these wings absolutely gorge. This yellow and pink really go well together. I like them a lot. Whoa! How did you even do that? Stub! Time to reveal me your artwork. Okay, well, I, I went with a caterpillar. Oh. Well, she has an actual butterfly picture. Nice work. Yeah, but look! My caterpillar metamorphosized! Oh, well, color me impressed. You're both winners. Yes! I love it when we both win. That's the best! Look, we got gum this time, and we don't even have to share! Yay, we're winners! Your next challenge is to draw a unicorn. Yes, I love unicorns! That's like a horse, right? I'm awful at drawing animals. Psst. What? Check this out. So much cash! It's yours if you draw my unicorn. Sarah! No! Draw it yourself! It's your loss. I'm gonna fail this round. That seems a little dramatic. 
I know a good hack for this. I'll place my hand on the paper and draw around it. Now I'll fill it in. It's such an easy way to draw a unicorn. I'll color it in now. Pink is the perfect color for a unicorn. Aw, it's so cute! I'll add more color to the horn. That was so quick! It's all done! Aw, look at it! Why are you so happy? Hmm, this gives me an idea. I can just copy Molly, but I'll make mine a rich unicorn! This makes the perfect horn! Good art costs money. What do you think? Seriously? It's the exact same as mine! Uh, no. Mine costs more. Yoo-hoo, teacher! Oh, look at that. Wonderful. Well done, both of you! I'm an artist! Fine. I'll let you have this one. Oops. I think I can work with these today. Orange and green. Mmm, no. Not good. Whoa! They're a brilliant shade of yellow! <sighs> this seems like a good spot. Such beauty! I have to get her attention! Perfect! But these flowers aren't mine! Of course! I can just buy one over there! But they don't come cheap, do they? Ugh. I've got nothing! I am a starving artist, after all. Anything in here? Just tons of paint! Guess that's it! Unless… This may be all I need! Women love flowers, right? Even if they're just painted on a page. Layer the colors with your fingers, and you can make some stellar designs. Check out these unique strokes. Now for the white in the middle. And just a speck of yellow. The green makes it really pop. This may be my best piece yet. Here goes nothing. For you. They're almost as gorgeous as you. Wow! Aww. This is for me? Of course. Thank you. You have to tell me how you did this! Oh! The next challenge is upon us. I've seen plenty of apples in my day. I know just where to start. And the perfect circle is key here. But where am I supposed to put the stamp? This circle takes up the whole page! <laughs> Ugh. Back to square one. Hmm. I could use a little inspo. Wait! I spy the perfect apple! Mm-hmm. She seems good and distracted. I'm going in! Mission Apple Impossible in full effect. I'm armed and ready. A clean, careful cut is all it takes. Huh? What is Annie doing? Knock it off! Sit down! Sorry! Ah, oh, man, I was close too! Huh. Guess I'll just draw what I know. Like the word. Apple. That's easy. P-P-L-E. Wait a minute. If I divide the word by five, or rather, an apple, I get one big step closer to my result. Okay, let's make that five a little bigger. Who knew the number could take up a whole half of an apple? You would never even know that it started out as a number. Especially not when you fill it in. With just the right blending, this thing jumps off the page. Oop, can't forget about the stem. Create a little shadowing. And a few extra little details. And this thing looks good enough to eat! Don't you agree? Ta-da! All finished! Me too. How realistic. And how… Flat. Well, this is a no-brainer. Bravo, Annie. I won! Yes! I wish I had a real apple. Me too. Ugh! Someone already chewed through this one! Ugh! Ha! <laughs> Luckily, mine's fresh. 
prepping for your art project is all part of the process. A messy one at that. Anyway, time to turn this idea into art. First stroke is always the best. Add a little bit of blue here. It's really coming together. Or is it? This is terrible! Nope. Good thing I have lots more paper. Ooh, smooth. This is worse than the first one! Ugh! Come on now, focus! You've gotta be kidding me. Why can't I paint a stupid flower?! All right. Stay calm. Deep breath in. I can do this. I am fully capable. It's go time. Easy. Easy. Chew! Huh? That was unfortunate. But wait a minute. What an interesting shape! I can work with this! Using your paintbrush in different ways can help you create entirely unique designs. And in my case, petals! Once you've gone all the way around, add some green for the leaves and stems. See how it's all coming together? Careful strokes go a long way. You can even attach these two. It fills out the space quite nicely. I knew I could do it! Whoa! You drew all this on your own? Why don't you have it, Annie? I've got more creating to do. And this time, I'm taking a whole new approach. But don't worry, we're still staying on theme here. See how these strokes make the leaves really come alive? Don't be afraid to take your time with these. You can even make grass, see? But the next part gets a little more complicated. I can use some puffy paints like these to create all new fun textures with a balloon! How satisfying was that? Now use it like a stamp. And you'll get these fun, totally unique flowers. Don't forget this one. Cool, right? Awesome! What do you think? <gasps> David! How did you even come up with that? My secret ingredient! Hmm. My crush has me feeling inspired. I sure hope he appreciates this. Here goes nothing! <sighs> What's up, David? Nice. What'd she write to me? Yep, I've got some feelings about this. <laughs> Be still, my heart. Let's see here. Gah! My books! Sorry. Let me help you with those. Oh. So soft. Uh-huh. Wow. Um, my books? Oh, right. So… Yeah. Thank you. I think I'm in love. Wait. Just one last look. Yep. This guy is really something. Ah. Uh, oh, that's what I'll say. Nothing like reminding your sweetie about the moment you first laid eyes on each other. The hard part's over. Nice. Wow. I remember. Such a sweetheart. Love you, baby. Hmm. Of course. A little realism is in order. Ladies? Um… <laughs> hey! Oh. Sorry about that. Is that a hand we're drawing? Okay, fine. I have a plan. Let's see. This hand could work. But this one is way better! Yet. Talk about lending a hand. All I have to do is trace this thing. I've got this round in the bag. Hey, look! One moment. 
Seriously? Okay. This thing's kind of fun. Actually, I know. Good girl! Huh? Annie? Huh? Well, that was odd. Got any wax in there? Huh? Knock it off, I'm trying to work here! Ugh! Wait, you know what? This may come in handy. Art is all about inspiration, not copying. And those twisted fingers got my brain going. Can't go wrong with red nails, right? This thing is really coming together. All finished! Where'd she go? Oh, anyway. Hey, hands up! Okay. Whoa, how'd she manage that? Mine looks so lame next to hers. Meh. Oh my word, stunning! Who's she waving in? Just my prize is all. And wow, this one's spectacular! I'm the art queen! Jealous? Good job! Don't even think about it. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Who's that guy? Check out his outfit! Where on earth did he come from? We should say hi! Hey, uh, pound it! Ooh, bare arms? Oh, no ink, no friendship. I'm telling the teacher on you. No ink? So ridiculous. Mister? Can't you see I'm working here? Ugh. First step done. Now what's next? Mommy! Nobody at school likes me! What? How much do tattoos cost? Nope. Don't even think about it. But maybe something less permanent. <laughs> you like stars, don't you? This is way less painful than a needle. Dip it in water and make a bunch of shapes. Time to go in for another dip. We can make a ton of them! See them all floating around? Oh, hold on. Hello? What you doing? Whoa! Ooh, refreshing! Is that me? Do my arms next! Do a spider! No, mom, I don't wanna go back. Aw, oh, man. I can't believe this. Oh, hey, you guys, look it! Uh, I have ink too, see? What? Hey! The kid's one of us! Look! Whoa! Those are sick, dude! Where'd you get them? My mommy! Hey! That's the coolest mom ever! Excuse me? Come back here! Good. Bye! Oh, my sweet, sweet good boy! So handsome! In fact, why don't you two draw him? Now! Oh, it's on! And I'm a doggy expert! It's just a head, body, and four legs! But this looks a little dull, doesn't it? Ugh! Let me try this again. I think bigger's the way to go. Ugh, still bad! Hmm! Nope. Still awful! Go! Oh! Hey! Huh? What? Calm down! Hey, I think I have an idea! I can use my hand as a guide. Because once I have the outline down, I can get creative with all the details. Trust me, this is gonna turn out awesome. See? Now all that's left is some color. And this good boy is giving chocolate brown vibes. Can't forget that pink tongue! A doggy trademark! Ta-da! Like what you see? The resemblance is uncanny. And yours? Uh, Annie? What? <gasps> <sighs> no drawing. That means you've won, Miss Emma. Ooh, these look delicious! Thank you! Chocolate doggies! I'm starting with this one. Looks good. Mmm, so creamy. 
No fear! <laughs> Calm down, dear. Just take one. Oh, really? Thank you. I need something that'll turn some heads. And I know just the thing. Complimentary hues for the win! But it's still missing something. But what? Ugh, this ball is so dinky. Whoa! That thing's blowing my mind! Mom! Oh, not now. Okay. You still have a lot of paint left. Which leaves room for me to play. Thank you! I just don't know what to do. Okay, I'll try a little. Hey! Where did my paint palette go? David? Is that you? Excuse me? Look! I did this! I call it pond water. Uh-huh. Oh, I know. You want to face paint? Give it a try, David. Whoa! Again! Fun, right? You can say that again! Yeah? What if I use my finger, too? Incoming! Ha! Ah, blue dots coming in, people! But now for my favorite color! Woohoo! That's it! Look, mom! Well, isn't this incredible? But let's try one more trick. Symmetry can sure be beautiful! And to prove that to be true, you created it all on your own! It's a gorgeous butterfly! This line will really make it come to life! Along with the outline of the wings! Other side! There! Just admire this pure beauty! And that's just the beginning, son! My nails look amazing! Hmm, getting the right skill is tricky. But it's fun. Yeah, sure. What is that? It's my ship. Whatever. Let me focus on my nails. That's fine. I need to finish this. Oh no! My pencil! And I don't have a sharpener. Oh, what'll I do now? What's wrong? My pencil snapped and I can't sharpen it. Uh, take this! Oh, okay. How does that feel? No! Use it on your pencil! Oh, right. I see. I'll run the pencil over the nail file. It's working! Look! Now I can finish my drawing! I told you! I have an idea. I'll draw you! Wait, I've been working on some poses. Ugh. How's that? Ugh, awful. Oh, I know! Go over there! Okay. Ready? That's more like it. I feel so glamorous. Put your hand on your head. Like this? That's it. Wonderful. How much longer? Hey! Ugh. I'm awake! What do you think? Uh, yeah. Good effort. This is my best work yet. Wow, that's really stuck up there. That looks chewy. Uh-oh! Hi. Take a seat, Ellie. Oh, okay. Don't look at me. She seems friendly. This color suits me. Uh, achoo! Okay, class. Open up your books. Do I have to? We have a very exciting lesson today. Yeah, right. I love her notebooks! I suppose I better take some notes. I know. My pen is super cute. I wish I had nice things. All my things are so boring. It's not fair! 
What's going on back there? Hold on. What's the problem? I have pen envy. Let me see that. That's one fancy pen. Maybe I can help. Really? Upgrade your pens with this simple trick. Remove the parts from the pen, then fill the casing with glue. Try not to make a mess at this stage. That should do it. Now pour in some glitter. Put the ink back into the casing. And screw on the nib. No more boring pens. Looks good, huh? Wow! Look at that! I can't forget about this cute little guy. Oh, he's so adorable. Thanks! Hmm. Wait there. Now I feel more comfortable. Wow! You're so stylish! I'll take those. These won't do. You need a makeover. I feel so alive. How… how did you do that? Who cares? I love it! You're my favorite teacher! Just doing my job! I feel amazing! What? Wow! I love your new look! Oh, I have something to give you! Really? For me? Thanks! Best day! Selfie! I love this class. Oh, I need to change. Ahem. So, today's lesson. New science was so interesting. Oh, a message. Oh no, I forgot Gina's birthday. I need to get her a gift. There must be something around here that I can use. That's a start. Now I just need to find a gift. Whoa! Ouch. Hey, I can use that ribbon. That's gonna hurt later. Okay, time to get creative. This is going well. There! It looks amazing! But what can I put in it? A doll? Hmm. Aw, another doll! Just what I need. Nope. Flowers. That's a good idea. They're beautiful! Uh, where did those bees come from? I got stung! Uh, I can't risk it. Now this is a good idea. Are you kidding me? No way! Ugh. Come on, think! Oh, I know! I can make her a journal! Start with an ordinary notebook. Open the back cover. And start to apply a thin line of glue along the edge. Do this along the side and the bottom of the page. Next, you'll need a length of pink ribbon. Stick the ribbon to the glue. Repeat this with more lengths of pink ribbon along the bottom of the page. Once you've done that, you'll need some green ribbon. Stick the strips of green ribbon along the side of the page. Don't leave any gaps. Keep it side by side. Now close the notebook over. Fold the pink ribbon over the notebook. Then thread the green ribbon over and under the pink ribbon. Continue this all the way up the notebook with each strand of ribbon. You'll create a lattice effect. Open the notebook back up and run a strip of glue along the top of the page. Fold the excess ribbon over the cover and stick it to the glue. Make sure it's pressed down firmly. Apply glue along the edge again, over the top of the ribbons. Remember to only put it on the three edges. Now put a sheet of card over the glue. Give it a press to make sure it's stuck in place. There! A homemade journal. I hope Gina likes it. I'm ready for Gina's birthday! I got you something! Wow! <sighs> Shredded paper! Thanks! Seriously? Look in the box. Oh, right! Thank you! You're the best! I know. You can't leave me, Mom! <laughs> I'll only be gone an hour, sweetie. Now get up off the floor. <sighs> I'll see you soon, okay? Play with your sister. Do I have to? Ugh, look at that face. Don't worry, we can play. Let's race the cars! Yeah! Well, I guess I can play that. I want the white one. Get on the floor, okay? Uh, 
and I wonder how long she'll be gone. As exciting as this is, why do boys love cars so much? Hey! I know how to make this more fun! I can just draw on the table! Are you insane? Very bad! Good thing I've got all these. Aw, oh, man! I think I got it all! What can we do now? Everyone likes soccer, right? Come on, it'll be fun! Hey, watch this! Catch! I missed. But it is fun, I guess. Hey, check out this trick! Cool, right? No! Gabby! What? You can't draw on all the furniture! I told you! Uh, sorry. But I know something I can draw on. Oh, I've got all this wall space! It's gonna be my big masterpiece! Here I go! My arm is so tired. Gabby? Where are you? <gasps> no! Oh gosh. I'm back, kids. What the? You're home! Look what I made just for you! <gasps> You're never watching her again! Oh. Ever! Ever! Hold up. I'm taking control here. Put the crayon down! Ooh. Gabby, don't do it! Put it what? I can't take this stress anymore! That was my favorite crayon! Wait, I'm sorry. Don't cry. Wanna have some fun with crayons? Simply use a blade to shave them down. And use a bunch of colors. Then press and spread. You can even draw on it. I call this Mr. Rainbow. Don't forget the legs. There. Isn't he cool? I love it! Can I try? Kids, I'm home! You have fun without me? Uh, again! Oh, I love seeing them play together. A rose under any name still smells as sweet. All right, yeah, it's flower drawing time! Huh. Oh no, my paint is totally tacky! Shoot, what am I gonna do now? I need art supplies. Let's see, which color should I start with? Pink, of course. No, you can't borrow this one. I need it. Please! My paint is all tacky and too dry! I said no. You'll have to figure something out on your own. Now, how do I want to draw my rose? I want it to be beautiful. Okay, yeah. I think that'll work nicely. Ugh. I can't believe she wouldn't share with me. She's so mean. I'm getting myself all worked up over this. I need to breathe. Whoa. I'm feeling a little lightheaded after that. Huh? What happened to my bag? Great. There's paint all over it. Get off paint. I said get off! <coughs> what the? Keep your paint on your paper, please. Huh? Use the bag to apply the paint. Oh! Oh, okay, got it! I guess I'll just dab it like she said. There's one. Maybe another one over here? No way! These are turning out great! Who knew? Let's see, what else can I do? I know! Where's she off to? Eh, doesn't matter. She can do what she wants. Just gonna borrow this. Yoink! Yes! Okay, I've got the paintbrush. Time to finish up my art. Can't have flowers without pretty leaves to go with them. Time's up. Let me see your rose artwork, please. Okay, I'm ready. Here's my picture. Isn't it beautiful? I mean, beauty's in the eye of the beholder, but no, it's not. Hers is, though. That's amazing! It is. And that's why she's the winner for this round. Yes! I want another one! I can't believe it! Ooh, candy! My favorite! Look! Yes, congratulations. Oh, Mr. Kitty, you're my favorite, yes you are! Oh, right, the challenge. Um, draw Mr. Kitty, I guess. Oh, okay, I love drawing cats. I just love cats in general. It's gonna be great. What is she doing? Is she just writing the word cat? What? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna win this one for sure. Okay, time to use my kitty drawing skills. I'll start with a circle. Cats can be round, of course. Especially if he's a chonky boy. Hmm, where should I go from here? 
time to turn my word into something even better. I'll start with this little face. Can't forget the whiskers, of course. Okay, head is done. A big long swoop for his back and his tail. So cute! Whoa! Good job! Let me see your kitty. Ta-da! Here's my finished kitty! And, well, I guess here's mine too. I got distracted. Oh, well, you can't win with unfinished art. So the winner's obvious. Wow, I did it! Me and my kitty won another round! Yes! Cookies! I love cookies! Hey, look! At last! A poppet! Wow! This is the best one yet! I need this to look amazing! First I'll draw a square. Then circles. I've got a better idea. Luckily, I keep this photocopier handy. Okay, pop it. In you go. And press copy. I couldn't have done it any better. How you getting on? That's it! I just need to color it now! Ooh, this'll be fun! I'll put a line of red paint here. Now the rest! It's like a rainbow! It's just like a poppet. I want to press it! Good job! I think I might have won this one. No way! I did it! You've got to be kidding! Look at mine! Step away from the table, ma'am. Give me your hand. And the other one. Don't resist. Using a photocopier is not drawing. We take cheating very seriously here. Sorry? <laughs> you think you know someone. Wow! A chocolate poppet! My two favorite things! Delicious! Okay, you're going downtown. Come on! Uh-oh. Whatever. Oh! It's a bird call. And your first art challenge. Hmm. Let's think. Ah, oh, this scarf. This shouldn't be too hard for me. What? Is that what I think it is? Get out of here, you silly bird! <laughs> At least that gives me a leg up here. In fact, I have just the thing to give me that extra edge. Ugh. How did this get in there? Whatever. As I was saying… Huh? Is this some kind of cruel joke? Okay, finally! My stuff! Oh great, another boring book. Not helpful. Goggles? None of this stuff is useful at all! What's all this math? Like I know what any of this means. On second thought, I can use numbers to help me. Once I get the body down, I can use a few magic numbers over here. And on the head, too. It's starting to look like a bird, right? Just wait till the color comes in. You okay there, my little chickadee? I'll give you nice, beautiful feathers. With all the colors of the rainbow. It's finished! What do you think? Can you see the numbers in it? Stunning! And you? I got stuck under some bad weather. This is as far as I got. Ooh! You won this round, Annie. <laughs> Aw, yay! For me? Thanks. Mmm. 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 I can't work under these conditions. I guess I should have seen that coming.